guys welcome back with me again Rati right here this is the way number two we are talking about the physical practicing way so this one is the most significant for activate your English or the way we're going to execute in our real talk in this video I'm going to tell you how I execute this activities in my daily conversation and I'm going to show you how to develop yourself by using these tips more importantly you have to take note because this is the exact ways the actual ways we have to follow and going to unlock our potential English so key number one about the physical practicing way you have to make daily conversation or going to talk going to have conversation every day at least with one topic so you have to set one topic to talk with your friends every day this is the way going to increase your thought and also going to help you build you to have the great habit of speaking English believe me I am doing this every day I come to effortless English with a team and I try to spend my own time to practice English by myself right there with the people especially I could raise a few topics or one topic as much as I can make sure that I can have time to talk to them at least I can spend time more than two hours for practicing English with anyone or with my friends key number two is that try to be active and motivational so what I want you guys have to do try to be active and motivational learn to motivate yourself and learn to get self motivation or like from other they're going to give you motivation the way you're going to persuade yourself to do something good for you and also learn to enjoy something good for your life you have to listen to them and try to do this as much as you can one day two days or more than other days and this is the way going to help you believe me by doing this you will become proactive person or you can speak English much much more better than yesterday maybe you come to do every day all right you try to practice English okay whatever with other friends but one more for the term two we have the basic doing thing as well term one we are focusing about the uh, you know materials that we have to learn or we have to get strong foundation to practice in English so just like we got using pronunciation all right we train about using dictionaries to help us learn vocabulary and also how to have habit of speaking English anyway like that so this is the exact way that I have uh, requested you all of you uh, go to do this but anyway we have done that so greatly and so far thank you so much so back to the point just like we have mentioned only the key number two so now we are going to be talking about key number three of the way of physical practicing way it's about key number three tell learn to tell a story so learn to tell a story is the way I want all of you understand naturally and you know generally so learn to tell a story or learn to describe something in English so this is the point going to extend your explanation and going to help you to have thoughts in English and you are gonna be amazing you're gonna be uh, you can speak English words a lot and also you can explain you can give something better about your explanation at least you know how to tell something well you know how to tell or describe something well with its reason so this is the point I want you to do go to tell a story as much as you can small things right big things are important at all or at the same cost so when you come to tell a story you are trying to explain and tries to be honest to yourself to tell a story right from the beginning until the end of the story you got to tell so this is the point that I want all of you understand right hopefully everyone learn to tell a story from now you are using my map to unlock your English when you know how to tell a story you will be come amazing storyteller yes and about key number four watching English stories so watching English stories this is the kind of interesting way that I want all of you you know have time to watch English stories learn to watch English stories to gain about the ideas or moral ideas why or what's going on to the characters okay like the actors actress whatever 
that you could see, that you could watch, and try to, I mean, give yourself like brief explanation or brief understanding about the English stories. Learn through this by going to YouTube or right, going to Facebook and also like the homeworks that I have dropped for all of you to do because I want you to increase your ability to understand when a story could be and try to use you know your ability to understand the story as much as you can by watching them every day if you could do all right so I suggest this is like the exact working way to help you to improve your understanding thoughts in English especially we are talking about the way or the ability to understand the story by watching them right so learn to watch them to increase American movies could be or like movies or animation could be uh, the movies or the videos in English so love to watch them it could be helpful key number five try to use natural and understandable phrases in your conversation so with this way I have dropped with a few keys especially we're talking about speaking point so speaking point this is the way going to give you or the place is going to give you about the natural phrases and also uh, phrases in point that we could talk and also try to use them to communicate with your friends and also with your classmates try to do this try to use them as much as you can you're going to be increasing how to use them right more flexible to understand something and this is called the phrases use them to upgrade your English also about the key number six you guys do not forget to improve your habit of listening and habit of speaking because this is the way even though you are learning English with me you got training from me you are my trainees and I am your trainer I come to train you how to have like the habit of listening and also the habit of speaking so this point is not quite difficult for you all to do just going to increase going to enjoy with the topic and also wherever you can go especially we have our online community effortless English ability that you can increase your habit of listening and also speak right there just come with one topic and try to listen as much as you can to your English partner and also try to talk you know as strong as you can so this is the point you're going to build and also you are going to enhance your English habit especially we are based on speaking and listening this is like the great way going to help you to have English ability or we call spoken English you're going to upgrade about your spoken English by doing this to key number six and also we have key number seven we call enjoy with the entertainment so enjoy with enjoy entertainment is the key I want all of you to do so just go to YouTube Facebook wherever that you can connect you can enjoy by using your phone or your computers try to get some fun or get joke whatever like get some laugh or right? get laugh with your friends with your people whoever could be with you try to laugh and make sure that you enjoy to do this as much as you can so the more you laugh the more you like to watch right so doing this going to help you to understand about English contents how the people make laugh in English and how you get some fun in English as well keep doing this as much as you can and all lastly here we have key number eight so key number eight about the um, physical practicing way we are actually talking about the ability we can connect or try to express our activities try to get or try to have your activities in English so all I have explained or all I have um, detailed you know from the beginning until right here and now we actually got key number eight so key number eight what I want all of you to do tries to use the materials natural material to study English or natural materials to master your English number one going to use dictionary long man of American English in case you cannot have long man of American English on your phone you can use website to unlock and also to read also to understand or look up some vocabularies right there as well this is the point key a part of key number number eight and this is like a part two also I want all of you going to exercise your mouth movement try to read okay read to, to do exercise about your mouth 
when you read more and more you're going to increase your mouth movement and also the power of saying thing is much more better to come out you can come smoothly as well so you have to train your mouth train your muscle or mouth something to do this this is like exact works of the doing exercise mouth all right hopefully and do not forget to record and also record your voice and also record your video do this every single day just you guys have done every day i am a you know i really appreciate a lot when you try to give the videos and also your voices to feedback or try to follow you know try to enhance your pronunciation this is the way we have done rightly so keep up the good work and also we're not going to study only six months could be enough but i do believe you guys try to use my map to unlock your english you can use every day and also non-stoppable i mean we could use this map to learn something especially for english to unlock something like that maybe you will be fluent in english and also you will be powerful in english especially you can be um you know great speaker in english anyway so all right hopefully you can use it forever i suggest this way thank you guys this is like the key number eight of the way way number two we call physical practicing way so hopefully you understand totally from the beginning to the end if you missed to understand one point of my video right here this is the briefing video about the fluency map so hopefully you uh, tries to get this as much as you can and focus pay attention as much as you can right don't rush if you have an equation feel free to ask me and i come to help you anytime as well we are family all right so do not mind that you got missing the point or you cannot understand we love to fix your problem and we love to have you honestly we try to do this as much as we can yeah no matter what okay thank you hopefully see you with the way number three bye bye